So today we are in Sunday in Brooklyn, which is one of my favorite places to have a breakfast and do a little bit of work. The main thing I wanted to share with you is this concept of doing your makeup for the evening during the morning. I don't like when makeup is too done and too, um, we say in French, figé. You see the makeup more than the girl. I like when it has a bit of life and accident, when it's not too perfect and too rigid. Then when I do a strong statement on my eyes or my lips, I don't like to make it too strong on the complexion. I'm going to use this uh, concealer around my lips, my nose and my eyes and this Charlotte Tilbury Dew palette to just highlight a little bit the highlight zone and just bring some warmth to my complexion and I'm gonna add um, a bit of pink blush but in a very very light way then I'm just gonna reuse a bit of the highlighter to push those zones on the cupid's bow, my cheekbones and in the corner of my eye I'm gonna start with this matte lip balm. I really love this product because it's not too dewy, it's very natural. I'm gonna use some eyebrows pencil to make my eyebrows a little bit thicker because I like when I have like such a strong statement on my eyes. And the first product I'm gonna use on my eyes is this um, jumbo pencil that I'm gonna have in my waterline between my lashes and on the top eyelid, on the bottom eyelids, but close to the roots. And then I'm just gonna blend it with my finger. It's gonna bring like some intensity in my eyes and also create a very good base to apply the pigments. This one is a pigment from MAC that is kind of an off purple that I really like. It's very metallic. I'm going to use it a little bit more on the bottom of my eyes and blend it on the outside in a like pointy shape. And then I'm going to use it on the top of my eyelid but like a little bit more on the corner and in the crease and then I'm going to blend it all over my eyelid. What I like to do with this look is to apply it with a brush but then I'm just going to blend it with my finger. And I'm going to use the lip balm I use on my lips, on my eyelid. The fact that it's matte, it's great because it's not going to be too oily and make the pigments move too much, but it's sticky enough to create like a good base. And then I'm going to apply the pigments with the brush. So I'm just patting it all over my eyelid. So you can see that the pigments are a little bit flying in the air, but it's not falling, which is great. But I love this one because it's a very metallic pigment. What I love about this texture is like it recreates a kind of a wet effect. So it's not wet, but it looks wet because the metallic with the lip balm will really create this texture. I think it's important to have a matte one because if it's oily then or shiny, then the lip balm will like make it move and your pigment are not gonna stay all day. But with this one, it's really gonna stay all day and make it like look very nice at night. So I'm tons of black mascara to make the eye pop. I'm just gonna touch up a little bit the concealer because every time I do strong eyes, I feel like my dark circles are showing more. So I'm not gonna put too much before. I'm just gonna wait and touch up when I'm done with my eyes so I see exactly the right amount of makeup I need. Now I'm gonna spray my face with um, this glowy spray. It's gonna keep my makeup all day and also it's gonna make my skin more glowy and dewy, which is nice for this look. My favorite part of this place is the pancakes. This is amazing, it's like a praline um, maple syrup and with the butter and they put it on the pancakes. You can see that I'm being very happy. Makeup has a really strong impact on my mood and honestly to have this beautiful eyeshadow on my eyes really inspired me to work and it's giving me energy. I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think of doing your makeup in the morning to wear it at night. I can't wait to read your comments.